Hello everyone, how are you doing? Welcome to Game Tech UK, welcome to Friday night. Uh, we're going to be doing some Gran Turismo 7 in VR tonight. So we played, when did we do it? Thursday? No, no it wasn't Thursday. Today is, uh, it was Thursday. It was Wednesday or Thursday when it came out and we did the uh, multiplayer in VR. That was brilliant. So we're going to do some more. Um, we're going to... Um, just do some GT3, GT4 stuff. We also might go down the PP levels as well um, and get back to that, get back to customizing some cars. So we'll probably do maybe um, uh, four to 500, something like that, PP. But uh, yeah, you can race with me. Everyone can race. Yeah, yeah. Oh, Paradise. Oh, cool son, bloody yeah. Of course he is. He sniffs VR. Paradise Decay sniffs it out and he's wherever it is. <laughs> how are you all anyway um hopefully you've had a good day i did stream earlier for a couple of hours bit of hogwarts that was really nice actually but uh yeah i've been really really looking forward to this i absolutely love it in vr this is just fantastic a nice classic car would be nice in vr yeah well i thought if we do um uh four to five then you can have whatever you want um what lobby my lobby i do a friends only lobby and it keeps it nice and clean then but yes uh Oh, let me turn my TV down. Sorry. Two seconds. I was playing this afternoon with the headset on, but I didn't have my headset, my earphones on. So I was playing with sound through the TV. So let me turn that down. Lovely. Yeah, so that's what we're going to do. A nice chilled out evening of racing. Um, slightly different to how I normally stream. Obviously, I don't want to say this every time because it's almost like I'm putting down this new way of streaming but in the vr headset obviously i can't see the chat normally when i'm racing i'm still reading out every single line of chat um but i can't do that in vr so that means that obviously there is less chatting but of course i take the headset off in between each race catch up with chat so it's more it's um more about the racing tonight absolutely which is which is awesome uh yes uh saying it's blurry and 480p yeah, it's all about expectations you know it's all about expectations people are expecting to put that on and it to be um just like real life and you know with with gran turismo itself if you go into the the vr showcase which we've done and you know you you're sitting in the garage honestly you can look at the paint and it looks like real life so forget what k it is that's not important it just means it's just perfect obviously once you go into the race yeah the resolution does drop a little bit and you can see a little bit of blurriness on the screen door effect but you're going to get that it's a headset it's a 500 quid headset but once you start racing it's absolutely stunning i didn't like the resolution in call of the mountain i haven't gone much on that at all but gran turismo for me is just magnificent absolutely magnificent uh, head placement is key yeah yeah where you've got it sitting on your head yeah definitely but you, you won't be disappointed it's not shit put it that way <laughs> it's not shit i think that should go on the box it's not shit <laughs> it's lovely it's great it's the overall package i see yeah exactly yeah and it depends on what game as well i've only tried two three games i tried the star wars demo it was all right i tried call of the mountain that wasn't as good as i was what i was expecting i've tried um gt and it was better than what I, what I was expecting so it's all about expectations how do i enable 4k on my playstation vr tech well that's all down to the game you, you don't enable nothing it doesn't work like that yeah it's not a pc you can't enable that Yes, Resident Evil Way, I'm going to be doing that on Sunday night um, uh, as a member stream start that, yeah, the Black Level Super Scary, yeah. Uh, Paradise, I know you're an absolute VR nut and you, you know you won't have a word said against it, but what did you think of Call of the Mountain? Honest opinions, honest opinions. None of that, oh, it's VR, so it's got to be good. Oh, it's the best. No, what's your honest opinion of um, not so much the game, but, well, a little bit of the guy, oh, climbing, oh, I'm having such a good time in VR, oh, this is brilliant, just, I just wasn't impressed with it, I really wasn't, and I think some of it is, um, I think I've just decided that that sort of gameplay in VR is not what I want to do, I've got no interest in shooters, like on the, uh, uh, the state of play yesterday, all five games didn't attract me at all you know just floating hands shooting it's just it feels like it's been done so many times this is a different thing altogether this is fucking amazing uh john we're not having to record you i'm not happy with the reprojection D did you find that the resolution wasn't what you expected yeah 
I want to see Jason play boxing in VR. You can, Anki. It is on the channel. Yeah, it is on the channel. I played uh, Creed on the PlayStation uh, VR 1. But yes, how are you? We're going to have a little chat. We always have a bloody chat here. We're a little bit different here. We always have a chat. And then we'll we start off with some some classics like uh, GT4 at Brands Hatch. Have a couple of warm-up races. Um, and, then, uh, and then we'll start veering off a little bit. Let me get that friend request. <clears throat> no, you don't need close friend. Just send me a normal friend request. You don't need to know uh, my uh, surname and I don't need to know yours. It's been super, super sharp. Yeah, no, it's super sharp. I get that. But the resolution isn't... If you, I take it you played Gran Turismo. You know, in, um, in the VR showcase, if you compare that with Call of the Mountain, they're two different... It's, it's almost like they're two different headsets. Yeah, no, no comparison at all. Yeah, see, you don't need to just keep asking the same thing over and over again. It's all good. Sony used Call of the Mountain as a tech demo in uh, Absence of Astro. But yeah, I'm sure it would be a good game. I'm sure it would be fine. <laughs> it's just the same thing. See, that's not how we work here. This is not... Um, this ain't a lucky uh, Fortnite stream. Hello, Sab. Sab Duncan, how are you? The Duncan's back. Are you coming to race with us, Sab? But yeah, I'm not knocking the headset. I'm just talking about what, what hits and misses with me. And that's all I can do. And Resident Evil 8 is worse looking, but I try and look past all that and just enjoy. Yeah, of course, look past it and enjoy the games. But when it's a day old, we, we've got to talk about that, haven't we? You know, we've got to talk about that. No, I need to be heard in live and some some people know that. Yeah, just be part of the chat, not the chat. here. simple as that. Um, hopefully you've left me all a little cheeky like. We are going to get in and have some bloody good races tonight. Not as much chat, I know, but it's all good. <laughs> Melody chill. Now you know what I need to do. <laughs> Brilliant. GT Sport versus GT7 in very. How many times better? Um, in VR, are you asking? Are you asking that? Hello, Johnny Wang. How are you? Do you have the Senna's 1998? Uh, I haven't got it. No, I think it is in this game, isn't it? I haven't brought it. <coughs> it's too expensive. I've only got 1.2. I think it's about 20 million. Something crazy. Hello, Victor. A VR, yeah. GT Sport versus GT7 in VR. Yeah, I mean... Uh, Naughty Nicky, how are you? I know, you're... You're Baz's missus, aren't you, Naughty Nicky? Yeah, I know. Yeah, but you're biased anyway. Sorry, Paradise, you are. <laughs> you're biased anyway. Yeah, Naughty Nicky, I'm sure that you're, um, and I love your profile picture, by the way. Uh, Rego, yeah, I get you. I don't know who you are, so I can't say I love you back, can I? That, that that wouldn't mean anything. Just stop it. Just calm down, everyone. Right, just calm down, please. It's not a Fortnite stream or a COD stream. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure Naughty Nicky is, uh, is Baz's um, missus. I'm sure it is. I'm sure it is. Ready to lag, yeah. <laughs> so we'll do a couple of Brands Hatch Classics GR4 and then we'll um, we'll get on with some others. Yeah, of course it is, yeah. So, oh, thank you, uh, Naughty Nicky. Thank you. And thank you, Bazaar. I appreciate that. Thank you. Umar, thank you very much. Thomas Sturk. He's a lovely geezer, Thomas Sturk. Welcome back. Thank you, Umar. What glorious beard that is. How beautiful is the world of Horizon? Does it uh, feel alive for you? Yeah, of course it does. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. I'm not knocking that part of it. Um, yeah, I'm standing at the top of the mountain after a fucking 20 minute climb. Looking around and yeah, of course it's beautiful. Yeah, yeah, of course it is. Yeah, absolutely. Want one of those headsets? Yeah, you'll get one, Bazza. Then you can move all your stuff to the rig then, can't you? Hello, Mark. Calm down, Mark. Calm down, every. What is wrong tonight? Is it a full moon out there? GT 4's first big dog, yeah. Is that what you mean? Fours, yeah, yes. Horizon looks bad. No, it doesn't look bad. It doesn't look bad. It just wasn't as, um, it wasn't what I expected visually. Yeah, that's not to say I don't like it. That's not to say it's no good. It just means that it wasn't what I expected. No, you shut up, Mark. <laughs> we we'll start our brands hatch just to get um warmed up. I think that's our little warm up thing, isn't it? 
Uh, oh, no, we're not going weld circuits, are we? We're going now. Right, let's go. Let's do this. I tell you what I love about the PlayStation VR it is just one cable. I still can't get hold of it. <clears throat> you sure you played Horizon on your PlayStation VR 2 and not your PSVR 1? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it behaves here, otherwise, you know. I know maybe English isn't your first language, but just, just chill. It's all good. Right, let's do a uh, friends-only lobby. We'll do it with five minutes of uh, qualifying as well, because yesterday, uh, yesterday, was it Wednesday night we did it? Whenever it was. Um, yeah, it was Wednesday, wasn't it? That's right. Uh, we was all... St oh, Umar, thank you very much. Thank you. I appreciate that very much. Thank you. That all goes into the pot, and I do genuinely appreciate it. Um, oh, God, what was I just saying then? Yeah, on Wednesday, yes. Uh, uh, I can't remember what I was saying there. Hey, Jason, I'm sick. Yeah, I'm sick too. You mean sick or... Oh, you mean not well. What's the next PlayStation VR 2 game you're looking forward to? <laughs> don't know. Don't know. I mean... Resident Evil 8 will be the next one I try. I'm not just going to go and try everything because it's all been done before and all the floating hands and shooting. But if something special is there, then I will definitely uh, try it. Yeah, just five lap races because that's perfect for um, uh, that's perfect for VR. You see, yeah, perfect. Right here we go. Let's start a, a bit of Brandy Snatch. Let's do it. Yeah, so of course in VR would be very, very nice, actually. We'll, we'll see. I'm sure other people will um, uh, tag on to it. Ribeye steak. Well, that will take you about, what, three minutes per side, Bazza? <laughs> right, grid star, uh, fastest first. No, should we have qualifier? I'll tell you what, let's do slowest first, just for these first few ones. That's fine. BOP is on. That's it. Let's just do the race so we can jump straight in. <laughs> the crew fee. Hello, Matt. How are you? <laughs> okay. Brands hatch. Preset weather. That's fine. GR4. Gosh. Yeah, I love how easy. All I'm going to do is a red light there. I'll press it. It'll vibrate and it's ready to use. You've you got to give them... You've got to give them props for that. Not the best build quality, I don't think, at all. Um, but it's enough. It's enough, isn't it? But, yeah, not the best build quality. Um, I'll show a veto on the Alpha. No, because I love the Alpha. <laughs> right, I'm just going to put this on two seconds. I love this pass through. Absolutely love it. There's Eva sleeping over there. Can you see? <laughs> uh, oh, stay seated. Set play area. Bosh. Right, let's reset it there. Turn this back on so I can get my gloves. Yeah, this, this pass through is fucking lovely and very, very usable. It's not even a gimmick. It's, you know, really usable. Really usable. Right, okay, uh, that's fine. Change car, love the Alpha. Of course we love the Alpha. Just make sure it's all good. It's a bit weird this bit, how you don't get the VR view until you go out of the pits there. Oh, I love it. I think G. Uh, I think actually GT uh, Gran Turismo 7. I don't think I'll play it in 2D anymore. I really don't. I think whenever we stream this, it will always be in VR just because it's so bloody good. It really is fucking the nuts, really. It really is. <laughs> oh, the other thing I did earlier for um, 
for immersion I turned all the race display off it was really nice actually yeah it was really nice just to have no overlay at all right okay everyone readied up we've got 15 people in uh, we've got Ben Sab Duncan's in we've got Giants uh, Oblifrec Blaster we've got Graham PB we've got some new names in here Glenn DJ Ken Balser Mad for it Mark uh, yeah awesome let's do this do it right only a five lap race we'll probably do this a couple of times maybe one in gr4 uh next one in gr3 then we'll start to move around i do want to do some slower cars today maybe four to five hundred pp that would be quite nice ultimately i want to have a car for every every pp sort of um situation so we could just race other things other than just gt3 and uh, gt4 means that yes I can't see the chat and yes that is strange for us but it's only one out of the many streams that we do where I can't see the chat just one so actually that lets me relax concentrate on the racing no excuses and hopefully what I what I lack in chat and messing about hopefully I might be able to replace in some decent racing for you because that's that's what we would like to see surely And in VR, I can put this car just exactly where I want it. It's so good. It's so good for clean, fast racing. I mean, look at it. I'm sitting inside an Alpha 155. <laughs> Fucking beautiful. And as a console experience, well, this is just... It, it, it's magnificent. Oh, shit. It's fine. I got it, I got it. Oh, 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 come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh shit, there they all come. quite like how in VR there's no look behind either so in most PC games even if you're in VR you can press the look behind button and it will work it's weird because obviously the overlay disappears but there's no option for that here you know you've got to use your your mirrors and the mirrors are such good resolution like shockingly good resolution again something in PC VR which is always a trade-off is things like mirrors in fact with um, with eye racing, you can actually turn some of the mirrors off if you're struggling uh, with performance. But yeah, they've they've given you the lot here. I swear there's a fingerprint on my lens, though. I might have to check that. back up there with Ken for sure. Yeah, love this alpha. So cool. 
iconic. close. Yeah, it's a lot easier in VR to position the, the car exactly where you want it. There's no guesswork, there's no bumper cam. For easier sort of peripheral viewing, it's, it's all there. You can feel the width of the car, the scaling is perfect. Oh shit, oh god, that's no good, that's no good at all. Balls. Oh, there's Glenn as well. <laughs> there's laggy Glenn. Well, that's why we always like a bit of a warm-up race, isn't it? Well, I'll try and keep my head as still as possible for you. Because the last thing you want is my head just going everywhere. And it doesn't look very nice to watch. Hopefully this should look not too dissimilar to when I'm playing in 2D. What you're watching. Obviously in, in actual fact it should almost look a bit more sort of, uh, oh I don't know, cinematic if you like. You know when I'm looking into the corner you're seeing a bit more of the, uh, the interior of the car. So it should be a better watch as long as I keep my head relatively still. But obviously I can't see chat. Glenn and his um, penalty. Last lap. It's definitely made Gran Turismo such a must-have title on the PlayStation 5. I mean, it really is top of the tree, isn't it? It's fucking lovely. Oh, God. Look at Glenn lagging about everywhere. <laughs> If you haven't tried VR, it's so hard to describe. I mean, that car is in front of me. My brain is, is being tricked into thinking I'm genuinely sitting in this car. And you just go with it, and the immersion is just beautiful. And that's not just, obviously, PlayStation VR. That's any VR. Right, I'm going to sort my lens out. I'm sure there's a fingerprint on there. Two seconds. Right. <laughs> Let's stop now. <laughs> You're blocking the car mirror. Uh, well, surely left would be exactly the same as the right wouldn't it? it depends on where you're looking that wouldn't really change anything i don't think yeah hello giant how are you let me get my little um microfiber cloth i got here you just brought it for 899 why why have you done that no it is good um yeah john i've noticed that oh thanks uh dick just stick it on the side there on on that one 
yeah just stick it on that desk thank you let's give that a little cheeky wipe thanks mate that's it let that dry naturally you're blocking the rear view mirror yeah so top left would be identical wouldn't it surely be yeah, absolutely identical <laughs> Oh, is it really head case? Oh, bloody hell. But yes, I have noticed when you're racing at night, um, it's uh, it lights up the cockpit, which is brilliant. Right, let's change this to... Um, no, the centre mirror. A surprise on eBay. What, you just get it from Sony, Ricky? What are you, what are you doing? You, <laughs> what are you doing, mate? Yes, I got it, Lou. But surely it's it, it's a it's a fluid view that you're getting, isn't it? So yeah, I'm looking ahead, um, and if if we go into a right-hand car, the mirror would be over there. It'd be exactly the same. The only the only other thing I could do is just turn it off. But then, you know, that's not that's not my stream, then, is it? Does he mean a PlayStation Five bundle? Uh, eight nine nine? No, it wouldn't be that. No, no. Yeah, I've got you, Lou, but I'm happy with it where it is, unless any, unless everyone else uh, thinks it's completely wrong. Here we go. Right, let me get that tea that my father-in-law lovingly brought in. <laughs> He's got no aspect of what I'm doing in here. He hasn't got a clue. He come in the other night. Oh, good night, mate. Yeah, thanks for what you done today. Yeah, yeah, no worries. <laughs> I had VR on. I'm racing. I can't see him. I don't think he even knows what I do in here. And he's just brought tea in. Lovely old git. <clears throat> right, let me get that. He hasn't got a clue what I do. What's your best VR game up to now? Yeah, this one. Yeah. Well, I'll be streaming Resident Evil VR. That would be Sunday night, but that would be for members only, that one. That's a members only stream. But it's like you were saying you didn't uh, didn't wear glasses before. I always wear glasses when I um, when I stream. Yeah. yeah. Oh right, now they're five five six nine, Ricky. Five six nine. Ah, oh, sorry, Rich. <laughs> right, okay, let's get in here. Gr three. We'll have the same race again. And then we'll start doing some other variables. Right, I'm going back in. I know we've got some other um, VR users uh, in the lobby tonight as well. I know Beard is, uh, is using VR tonight. You can see, I can see the chat, but I just can't see the chat. It's a bit blurry, so that's a shame. Uh, right, here we go. That's it. We just go to track, make sure it's all good. Love this car. This is one of my favorite cars, actually, in, in the game. The Porsche RSR, it's fucking beautiful. Oh, God, I love VR racing. I really do. Like I say, I don't think I'll play Gran Turismo in 2D anymore. I think it will, this, will be a, this will be a thing. Yeah, this will be a thing. Accept that. Oh, fucking hell, I've just done a close friend. Don't send a close friend. For fuck's sake. It's not hard, is it? Um, oh, fuck's sake. It says on there, no close friends. Anyway, uh, let's uh, let's do it. Fuck's sake! Right, five lap race, same thing. We, this is our warm up. I'll be warmed up by now.
Whoa. Johnny Wang had a little tear up there. Oh, Ben's had the tear up as well. He's all right, it's fine. Can everyone just stop squirreling? Yeah, it's nice that I can just get on and just concentrate on the racing. It's quite nice, actually. We'll do some uh, random tracks tonight, tracks we don't normally do. Of course, we'll do the ones we normally do as well. But I want to go to All Saints. Um, definitely want to go there. I want to try all tracks in VR because it just changes it up, doesn't it? Like even Red Bull Ring, you know, I want to... I want to race there. Everywhere. Nautschleifer, of course. I'm, I'm more relaxed now, this is cool. Ben's in the dirt box. Right, on to Johnny Wang if I can catch him up. I'll do some daily race streams as well in VR, that would be quite interesting, wouldn't it? I should imagine the haptics would be going off for that one. The haptics in this game are pretty useless, let's be honest. You're only going to fear them when you're crashing into a fucking barrier. The, the haptics in this game are really not going to affect you too much. It's not like they're going off for rumble strips or anything like that. It's just when you crash badly. The rumble strips in Call of the Mountain are very cool, actually. There was a bit there just as the the, um, the intro credits come up, and they all fly over your head and you, you feel it. Um, yeah, it's really, really good. from the pack I can't get Johnny Wang and quite the funny thing even though when you play this in in 2d obviously people say it's sim code and that's fine I agree with that but it sort of elevates itself to sim level when you're sitting in oh fucking hell when you're actually sitting inside the car it makes it regardless of simcade or sim it um it feels like you're in the car so surely it feels like a simulator which it absolutely does in vr it's quite interesting actually work my way back up now. I know Graham is in VR as well actually. In front. behind <laughs> I'm just looking down at the carbon weave on this steering wheel fucking hell it's so the detail is just oozing in this game it feels like there's no trade-off nothing's being traded off you know the lighting's good the interior's good just everything's good there's no oh yeah that's because of performance it's it's it doesn't I'm not feeling the trade-off it's a complete package with regards to a VR racing game, it really is. Even like the grass, you know, that's usually in VR one of the first things you do. Turn the grass to low, you don't need it, it takes a lot of performance. The grass looks realistic, it actually looks like it's sitting up. There's, I can't see where the trade-off is, is here. 
very very impressive and I'm happy just with this as my purchase I'm not even that fussed about a load of VR gaming this is what I purchased it for as soon as they said this was coming then I got straight on and pre-ordered love your racing games then you can't really get better than this, not really. That was a nice uh, squeeze through there. Don't break there. job of making his car feel very wide. <laughs> mm. Fucking hell. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Brilliant. some kind of fingerprint issue I've got. I don't know if it's my glasses or what. More pipe and slippers close friend requests. Yeah, I don't want to give my surname out to people. I don't want to. And plus, it, it says on there, when you do a friend's request, do you want to know this person's last name and they will see your last name? Not necessary. <clears throat> Right, here we go. Let's go on to something else now. How are you coping with the sickness? I've got zero sickness in Gran Turismo. I did feel a bit weird after about an hour's gameplay in um, in Call of the Mountain, especially because I was standing up, and when you push it forward to go to, to move, it's like, oh, you know, sometimes you feel about that, but it's only because I haven't played much VR in the last whatever years anyway. That's all right, Stuart. That's all right. Just... Uh, Forgive my pipe and slippers rants. <laughs> right, okay, let me have a look here and see where we can go. Let's have a look. Yeah, let's go to Laguna Seca. And we'll stay in GR3, actually. Yeah, GR3's all right. I'm going to use another car. Yeah, let's do that. Let's see if I can choose a different car, actually. Oh, I like the uh, the Nismo. The GTR. Let's get ourselves in there. I haven't actually tried this track in VR on this game. Hello, Mad for it. How are you? Yeah, thank you to everyone that's come in. I do, I do appreciate it. You're Xander. I've got you switched on. Yeah, yeah, no worries, mate. Yeah, Graham, you've got VR, haven't you? Because you left me a message saying that you like my slippers. That was you, wasn't it, Graham? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, no Silverstone. Right, back in. Yeah, in the GTR, I love the interior of the GTR. It's very, very good. Oh, I can actually see that P 
UK gifted one membership. Thank you, Pete. Thank you. Oh, if I'm close, I can see it. Real Village is oh, Resi. Yeah, I can I can see it. Pete, thank you very much, mate. I appreciate that. <laughs> you you saw my efforts of reading that. <laughs> Yeah, I definitely feel like there's a fingerprint or something happening. Weird. Lovely, look at that. Jesus. Oh, this is gonna be cool. Right, let's let's get straight in. No practice. Let's start the race straight away. Five laps, perfect. I'm nice and warmed up now. Oh, see, look, it's still starting me in the same position. That's not fair. So I think in future races now, we put, we'll put in a five-minute qualifying. That just gives you a chance to do one lap then, doesn't it? It's not fair that, you know, I keep starting fourth, Johnny Wang's first. Um, we want to mix it up a little bit. I'm going to be racing for a good few hours tonight, though, so get yourself all set in. Beautiful car this is. Here we go. Oh god, it just elevates this game. Every car is like a is an event. You don't get that in 2D. You get the overlay. They all look similar. Dashboard, dials, steering wheel. But when you're in VR and you can actually see and feel the seating position, it's something completely, completely different. Right, can we, can everyone just stop getting shot? Every car feels like you're really, like I say, different seating position. Every car feels different. That's why I honestly don't think I'll do much 2D in Gran Turismo anymore. Not when, not when this is available. It's criminal not to. The light in as well as it comes for over the steering wheel there, look. Whoa, lovely bit of elevation that is. <laughs> like I say, this is not the first time I've experienced all this. You know, I've got I've got PC VR, I've even got a motion platform. But this is doing it very, very well. It really is. And once you get into it, there's nothing like Gran Turismo, really, is there? Right, five out of 16. But like I say, we will start introducing qualifying. It's not fair that I'm starting fourth, and it's just not right. Why Gran Turismo hasn't got a random feature for the lobby, I don't know. How hard would it be? And you've got your body down here, the feet move, the arms move. There's none of that floating hand shit. You, you, you know, you really do feel immersed because you look down and that's your body. That really helps. It's better than just a floating um, steering wheel. the fact I haven't got the list of um, uh, you know like the relative so I don't know who that is behind me I don't know because I haven't got the list of cars up on the screen like you would normally have so I've got no idea who that actually is no I still didn't see I'm gonna find out now though aren't I Belsa Ha <laughs> 
It's just so good. So good. Even the helicopter looks cool, floating around above you. Also the actual car itself has got a nice bit of body roll. Probably too much actually, if you go to Daytona it really does swing up and you're like, whoa, what's happening to the car? But on general tracks, the way that the body rolls over stuff is just so convincing. More than I have seen in other games, that's for sure. to this car I thought try something different Right, next we'll um, we'll do a race at Alsace, but we'll use our, our own cars. I'll put the PP to four to 500, um, and you can bring whatever you want. It'd be quite interesting, actually. You can have tuning, put on what you want. I'll open it all up. I think for between four and 500, I've got my BMW M3 series. Let me know for when I come back, what's the view like? Is it watchable? Am I moving my head too much? Not enough? I'd love to know. A little bit of feedback on this, because I'm in control of the camera of my head. It's quite the responsibility. <coughs> my hair's going to be ruined. <laughs> All good, okay. <laughs> Very good, but no wins. Yeah, I'm just warming up, don't you worry. He's back again. Yeah, Donington, it's not in the game. All good, okay. Right, okay, so let's change this. <laughs> Steam generally is great. <laughs> Yeah, that is a bit weird, but I quite like it, John. I don't mind. Um, it just adds a bit more immersion, doesn't it? Yeah, I don't mind that. I understand what you're saying, though. Um, let's go to the village. Let's put it on qualifier. Number of laps, five. Um, fast is first. BOP is off. Um, five. Yeah, that's fine. Five minutes of qualifying, absolutely fine. Now we'll put no limit, and PP limit will be 500. 
So you can you, you can bring in and, and we're going to do more of this now as well because we're back into Gran Turismo properly. So the idea being is that you've got this arsenal of cars. 200 pp 300 400 500 600 700 that we can just say oh should we do like 800 pp tonight and then you pull out your weapon and you do it that way so yeah i'll put this as a limit of 500 you can just bring in um whatever you want whatever you've got yeah i think that's it so now i will go change car um, that's a bit weird. It shouldn't show everything, should it? It shouldn't show everything. It should only be cars that all regulation compliant cars. Hmm. Oh, I suppose it's the ones flashing you can't do, but it should still should do it in a different way. Yeah. Um, I'm going to go in the M3 anyway. Yeah, can't be switched. That's not a problem. Again, you could choose. I've actually chose to put um, a little bit of lower in on this and then um, brought a power restrictor to bring it down just below 500. But uh, yeah, you can do whatever you want. I'm just going to nip to the little boy's room. I'll be back. Two seconds. How am I feeling? On top of the world, mate. Uh, so Mark's got, a, <laughs> well, they should all theoretically be um, be competitive if they're under 500, yeah. So we've got a WRX, that would be a good choice. Giants is using a Classic there. Oblivrec is using the Clio, that would be another good one. Mad for it in a Super, free, uh, super uh, Supra, sorry, 3 free, uh, free litre GT Turbo. Johnny Wang's in a little Spider. Yeah, this will be cool. See, I, wanna, I like doing this... Um, this lower PP stuff, I like it. Just send me a friend request in the um, in the description. It's in the description. Combustion corner, you're welcome, mate. Right, let's get it on. Uh, we've got five minutes qualifying as well. DJ Ken's got a roaster, uh, roadster. Bells has got Sierra. Nice. This is interesting. Lancer. Yeah, this is going to be good. Right, I'll swap over. gloves on I still like my gloves even though I'm in VR All right, let's go to track I'll put a roll cage in this as well just because why not This is going to be a bit different to the classic GR, uh, GR3 and GR4 stiff suspension. This is going to be this is going to be good. This is where we get some really good racing. Boom! <laughs> Fucking hell! I sent Mark into next week. Right here we go. 
Everyone's ready to up. Let's do our qualifying. <laughs> <laughs> that fucking showed him, didn't it? <laughs> Hang on, my glasses don't feel comfortable. That's it. All right, so I've got mediums here, so th there's there's a definite. Um, why won't this let me out? Oh, we had this before, didn't we? Well, you had to come out and then go back in. Yeah, weird. Yeah, there's going to be slower cars, but softer tyres. It's going to be interesting, yeah. Pretty round here, isn't it? So I have managed to lower this a little bit. I've got a roll cage, I've put some side skirts on. That's all I was unable to do within the 500 PP. I don't know how it'll be, if it's competitive. It's quite interesting bringing whatever you want, isn't it? Lovely track this is. What's Beard got? Is that an MR2? Going back to that thing we, we spoke about, about Gran Turismo in the old days, you know, when you, you get a car and you, uh, you know, you, you soup it up a little bit, especially GT1 where you was able to um, put spoilers and things on, you get that sort of, feels like your car, that, that car ownership, oh my god, do you get it in this, wow. I wanted to swap the wheels on this actually, but it's got the original BMW wheels, I just couldn't bring myself to swap it. It looks so nice, but I took this car into um, into the the VR showcase once I put like the side skirts on. I just thought, wow, this is just so good. Because they're not any old cars, are they? They're your cars. That's why we will do more of this racing, and we'll pick like six, to, uh, you know, up to seven hundred PP, up to eight hundred. This is a this is a good way to race rather than just doing the GT3 and GT4 all the time. Do some night racing tonight as well. Night racing seems more viable in VR than it does in 2D as well. You've got a lot more sort of, or you feel like there's more ambient light, like you can actually see a lot more. Qualifying's best, isn't it? If only it had a random feature. Oh, I got you, I got you. Second at the moment, which is alright.
and we're off. Oh, felt the rumble that time. <laughs> okay, we just have to hope that that um, first lap was half decent. Slips though, have to watch her. Yeah, we've still got third at the moment. Here's the banter bus. Okay, cool. <coughs> Don't know why that's all the way over there. That's it. Right. Start race. This is going to be interesting. Yeah, I got a third behind DJ Ken in the end. That's all right. And Glenn's behind me, so perfect. <laughs> Someone's got the on. Lovely car, isn't it? I've got a bit more straight straight line speed than Ken. I think he's got soft tyres, which is obviously going to give him better grip, but we've got the We've got the um, tire and fuel well on five times as well so obviously the softs are going to deteriorate faster oh god look at this light coming up in my rear view mirror this when we do this this feels more like gran turismo random cars um rather than just like something that feels like maybe acc with uh with just a lot of gt3 and gr4 cars this actually feels like gran turismo now Look at that Cosworth, she is beautiful. Yeah, this is, we've always had fun with this. Okay, but a little M the uh, the BM seems competitive enough. Oh, don't do that! Fuck! Oh, oh god, that felt good. <laughs> Fucking, hell, I'm at the back. Shit! <laughs> I really am at the back. Oh balls! That felt great, like sliding in the middle of the road and then looking out the window and seeing everyone coming towards me. That's why I did it, really. I did it for your benefit. Oh, God, what? Might need a little bit of traction on here just to calm it down. We might even do this race again straight away afterwards. Now we've had a bit of a practice in these. We've got a few more laps, so it should be good. We should be able to do something. That's a really fluffy steering wheel.
<laughs> the sun actually fills in the sky like it could be it's hot in this room it actually feels like the sun's coming in the car Really good track this is, we've had a lot of fun around this track. Oh, there's another M3. This game is so different when you get out the uh, the race cars. It actually becomes quite a challenge. <laughs> so cool. Back up to temp with three in front of us to see if we can catch them up. He's doing the gears for me, look. Look at this. <laughs> the animation's fantastic. I see what someone said in the chat about, you know, it's a bit disconcerting with your hand over there, but I just have that as part of the animation. It just sort of, it doesn't really worry me too much. I understand what you mean, though, when you've got both of your hands on the steering wheel, but there's a hand over there doing the gears. I'm just sort of not paying too much attention to that. I should have known that was Glenn from the lagging. All right, we might be able to catch up Glenn and the Sierra Cosworth. Glenn does lag like that. I mean, he's got good internet. Oh. Yeah, don't break there, for goodness sake. Sorry, Bell. Oh, God, he's not going to be happy with me. That was proper breaking on the corner there, though. He didn't need to break there. Sorry. He's, oh god, he's killed someone already. <laughs> what fucking colour scheme have you got there, Glenn? that it's fun to watch I know we're not we can't chat as much but I'm hoping it's fun to watch especially if I can improve my racing in VR although I've had a couple of accidents tonight I don't mean like accidents like piss myself I mean on the track well I may have done I don't know I haven't checked
Right, I've got two more here. Obviously, I don't know who they are until we get up close enough for the, uh, the name tag to display. That's Graham. Yeah, I wouldn't mind going again here if you're if you're up for it. Could maybe put this to night time maybe, if they do night time here. Coming up behind Don now. We was last, but now we've moved our way up to seventh. I'm sure we can do some more as well. There's one there. See what I mean? Totally way of different way of driving when you've got these slower cars. Don 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 da don don da don 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 I just have fun on my own when I can't see the chat. It actually feels like the sun's in my eyes. I have to put the visor down. <laughs> yeah, without crashing, I think I'll be quite competitive in this car. So we'll go again. in the bank bus. I think I'm going to nick anything here. No. Oh, we didn't even get a chance to bloody finish. How about that? ETS is VR. Yeah, 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 it is, yeah. What on earth is going on? <laughs> Thank you for coming in. Sorry I can't see the chat throughout the race, but we're just concentrating on, on the race. There's 260 in here, so that must be semi uh, sort of interesting. And I thank you for sticking around. Uh, I f I'd like to do that again. Who's in the mobile chicane? <laughs> Who's the mobile chicane? That's Mark. Mark. Uh, let's go here. He's actually in VR, I was joking. Uh, can we do... Where's the time? Oh, yeah, yeah, here we go. Yeah, let's do night. Let's do the same race, but at night. You're on lesser tyres, yeah, but I, I, I quite like that. I, I think it, I think it would be all right. Yeah, I haven't got enough PP to put soft tyres on there. I'm going to leave it as it is, and I think we'll be all right. 
Is this Xbox? No. I mean, you must know Xbox doesn't have a VR. Also, reverse the grid. No, we did qualifying. That's, yeah, we're doing five minutes qualifying. Right, everyone ready up and we'll get going. Oh, yes. If, did I just do your friend request, Jeff? Sometimes you have to shut down Gran Turismo for it to register. And yeah, you've just done that, so it should be fine. I'm just going to go and get my air con because it's fucking hot in here. It really is. This will be cool at night. Where's me, um, here it is. That's better. It gets roasting in here with the, uh, the door shut. Yeah, I mean, if, if Euro Truck does come to console, which I said it is possible with this new update they're doing, imagine if um, they could get the headset working as well. <gasps> that would be brilliant. Right, let's, um, let's race. Everyone's ready. Giants, uh, Graham, yeah, if you can ready up, that would be great. But yes, thank you for sticking around. Can you invite me? You don't need to. Just make a friend. Uh, make me a friend. And then you can join friends' lobbies. But yeah, I'm very happy with the headset. Very happy indeed. It's cool. You could work for Sony. Why? Why, Liam? I don't work for anyone. I work for myself. <laughs> oh, you like it, Dion, dear. What are you playing, Dion? What are you mostly playing? Yeah, I'd love it if um, if you take this second just to leave a little like. I don't ask for anything. I don't ask for people to subscribe or anyone got any messages popping up. None of that. But I would like you to leave a like. And if you're feeling generous, a share. That That's all I want from you. Um, other than that, you just stick around um, and feel free to hang around for all the other stuff we do. Right. I'm guessing that our woods and Oblifrec haven't got anything ready, so I'm going to start. Um, is Sab in here or is Sab coming in? Because we're full up at the moment. Is Sab already in there? Because, uh, yeah, we're full up. Oh, Sab's there. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I got you. <clears throat> I on PlayStation uh, did not know if you add me. No, you add me. You add me. That's the way it works. You add me, and then you can join my lobby, Mike. That's just the way it works. Yeah, Stuart, I'll be doing that Sunday. Yeah. Oh, definitely, Bazaar. Even, like, the M3 is a beautiful car to drive, yeah. And the Cozzy's lovely. GT7 and Mirage to relax. I just got Horizon. Nice. Right, is Sab ready? Because we're sitting here waiting to go. By the time I get my headset, then I'll start it. There we go. Put the old glasses up. Lovely. This is me. This is this is what I look like. This this is me. So <laughs> it's weird, isn't it? With with the view, it's quite weird. Oh, Eva's not in here now. She's gone. I think when my father-in-law opened the door, she sodded off. This is going to be cool at night. Oh, God, yeah, this is going to be really good. Oh, nice. Look at all the orange lights. Yeah, the classic orange. I just totally forgot about that sort of orange light. I'm sure you could change it between orange and something else. I could swear that you could change that. Yeah. Oh, that's really cool. I like that. That's proper retro. <laughs> I'm sure you could change the BM from orange, maybe green? I could have sworn you could choose. There was two colours. Maybe I'm wrong. I usually am. Right, let's go. Start qualifying. Well, five minutes qualifying. Um, I think that's the fairest way to do it. It gives you a chance to get used to your car. Oh, Beard's going for an R R5 Turbo. Nice. You 
don't need to start a party with me. You, you don't need to do that. You can see I'm streaming. And if it just sits there, come out, and then go back in. I don't know why it does. Yeah, very strange. I'm actually sticking one traction on here just to make it behave itself. Oh, come on. What's going on? Come out. Go back in. What the fuck? Oh no, it's alright, we're away. I just wanted to itch my forehead then and you realise you've got fucking plastic all over it. Don't uh, keep starting a party because otherwise I'll just take you off my friends list so you can't do that. You can see I'm streaming, please. You don't need to do that. You can see the head, you, you can feel the headlights from behind glow up your sort of dashboard. It's so cool, such a great effect. I've never experienced that before. Bloody hell, then. I've changed my headlights actually to um, the icy white ones. Nighttime racing feels much more viable now and doable. Time for one more lap. I've got this bloody one and a half minute penalty, which is going to hurt. <laughs> I love the fact you can see all the rest of the track over there. I'll put my hand up as if you could see. <laughs> really cool. Got a blimp balloon up there. Or blimp. Penalty to get off, haven't I? You see the, the light from the, the car behind you? It's a really, really nice effect. There's the balloon up there. <laughs> oh, it's such a treat. What a treat to be able to sit down of an evening and do this. What a treat. Better than going to any bloody arcade. The games are at home now, aren't they? And have been for a quite a while. Beautiful. 
full light in. And who better to brace with than the fucking lovely people in this community? Some of them in this room, we've been racing together now for around five years, which is crazy. I'm right up the back in 11th, so let's do this. Yeah, that, that little spin at the start ruined that for me. Because not only did I spin, but I also got the uh, penalty as well. It's fine. It's all good. I think we'll be all right. I don't know what my own button is. It seems more exciting like this, doesn't it? The fact that there's so many different cars and variations of tires and engines and suspension. This is this is actually really good. Oh, I like the look at that Ferrari there. Bloody hell, DJ Ken was at the front, wasn't he? I'm sure he uh, got pole position. <laughs> Fucking hell, Ken. Look out, mate. going for a bit of tuna fest J Japanese car like it well we've moved up a few places but I'm not sure this has got enough oomph now to to take me up anymore. This is this is getting addictive now. This uh, sitting in VR and just racing. This is fucking beautiful. There's Don, 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 Don. <laughs> <clears throat> Just to let him know. Just to let him know. coming through, there he is. The Lancer's got some uh, power on it, hasn't it? Lacking that grip because I've only got um, uh, medium tyres on and not racing medium, just oh fucking hell, so, oh shit, just um, sports mediums. Mm. 
but we'll intersperse these sort of um, your own sort of private car races with some GT3 and GR4 stuff. We'll go back to GR4 in a minute. Maybe a bit of classic bar first, what do you reckon? We can tell that because I've got this this haze of white light behind me on my dashboard, which is so cool. I don't know if you, if I really sort of noticed that in 2D. I can't remember. I'm sure I did. Yeah, GR3 at bar first, I think. What do you reckon on that? I think this um, BMW's got potential to be to be competitive in this four to five hundred range or up to five hundred, but. I think the tyres are letting me down. I, put, I could put sports meter, you know, racing mediums on, but then I'd have to strangle a bit of the power. We will try it. I suppose what you what you lack in oh, you lack in power, you're gaining in grip. So if we're doing these up to a certain amount PP races, you've got a real choice, haven't you? You could take a higher rated PP car and um, restrict the power, or you could take a much lower powered car and kit it out. I mean, it's quite there's quite the variables there. And we always race GT3 and GT4, but in Gran Turismo Sport, this is what we used to do mostly. You know, we've done championships, we've done leagues, we've done everything. We pick cars and, uh, you know, themes, loads of stuff. So that's what we'll start again now we're doing this. I do need the grip. helicopter there in VR you know even like the helicopter is just such a cool effect in 2d it's just there isn't it but the helicopter is there it's right there and then even higher you've got that um, blimp or whatever you would call it there's a lot of depth in VR that you just don't get in 2d I can't catch Don can I been hugely competitive tonight so hoping to make up for that in the next race GR3 
at Barfell, something I'm familiar with and half decent at. So hopefully I can build up a bit of racing confidence, as we call it, with a little cheeky win there. You are welcome to join in if you are watching. You don't have to be in VR either, you can just join in if you want. Um, my gamer tag is in the description. Just send me a friend request, I'll accept it, and you can join in. As long as you're clean, you're welcome. No dirtiness. <laughs> I just can't catch him up, can I? I'm acting to slow down and nurse it through the corners too much. So if I can get some, even racing hearts would be better, wouldn't it, than the sports mediums. Last lap anyway, then we go to Bar First or Mount Panorama, as it's called in GT. Nick it off him here, lovely. Oh, I'll have that, thank you very much. Cool. everyone <laughs> is it a bit weird um that we're not chatting do you find that weird or is it all right i'm all right with it because i know other streams um you know we can do that i know that but uh yeah are you still enjoying it i come back after every one don't i which is the important thing i'm not just going to stay in in chat for bloody ages right uh where did i say oh yeah mount panorama Is it all to all the way back there? I know, I know. Don't worry. This this will make a difference. This one, this one's for all you lovers out there. <laughs> right, GT three. Let's fucking smash it. Uh, are you look? Are you going tick in with friends, Mike? I am enjoying it actually. Yeah, I am enjoying it. Uh, let me just double check. So, Mount Panorama, um, Uphill Feather. There you go. You probably will have to shut Gran Turismo and then set it up again. So, if you haven't already done that, Mike, then try that. It doesn't work, Graham, with the motion rig. The motion rig doesn't work with um, with console. 
Uh, yeah, afternoon, that's fine. Uh, fastest first, that's it. Um, that's it as well. GR3. Um, where's tuning? No limit. Where's, uh, where's, um... Am I being blind? Where is it we can... BOP on. Oh, cars mm. settings. Oh, BOP is on. That's it. Um, prohibited. Oh, I gotcha. Yeah, that's it. Right, okay. Here we go. Oh, you're Don, are you? Oh, okay. Okay. Have you changed your name, Mark? That's all right, Mad for it. We ever consider getting an Xbox? I've got an Xbox. Yeah, I've got an Xbox. There we go. Right, this should be good now. Yeah, this is proper. I bet, Beard. Yeah, and I'm glad that you're enjoying it as well. Yeah, I'm glad you're enjoying it. Hello, British Ace. How are you? And thank you to everyone coming in. Like I said, I can't really see chat in between, but we're just concentrating on the racing. I love having you here, chatting in between each one. The motion rig uh, can work. Sim Hub now supports GT7. Mm. Okay, I'll look into it, Andy. Yeah. If it does, then I'll get one. Oh, I've got you, Lars, yeah. Because GT7 is now... Um, output in oh, what's it called when it outputs the data um i think gt7 is now finally output in the data uh, the data i know i'm using sim hub and what have you got the um uh the next level of you andy because if it is then i'll get one yeah oh i got you andy yeah yeah maybe i'll hit you up with that andy are you on twitter have you added me on twitter yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll be happy to get that. I, would I be able to keep my steering wheel plugged into the PlayStation, just have the SIM hub for the motion platform? I mean, that would be great. The only thing wrong with that, which I'm not even fussed about getting it working, is the fact that when I'm sitting here in my motion platform streaming, my head's shaking, and it changes the view for, for you. Now, it's nice and smooth. I'm being uh, trying to be the best that I can with my head. If I'm sitting here shaking, it changes it entirely. So, yeah, I'll look into it. Yeah, yeah. Right, let's get back in and let's do this. Yeah, get into the pits but can't move. You have to come out and then go back in. Yeah, you can plug direct. Yeah, it's worth doing, isn't it? I'll get one. I'll definitely get one then. Uh, right, back into VR in a minute. But yes, Ken, just go back in. It's so bloody seamless, isn't it? Just putting the uh, the headset on. I love it. It's comfortable. It's uh, yeah, it's cool. Right, this is this is where we're gonna we're gonna get a first place here, everyone. I fucking guarantee it. Right, what tyres we got? Yeah, that's it. We're all ready to go. Right, start qualifying. No. The room's being prepared. Someone's got a ready up. Sab, an uphill feather. Or uphill feather. If you can ready up, that would be great. Johnny Wang, if you can ready up. An uphill feather. Fuck's sake. Bloody Gran Turismo. There's only 15 of us in. And it all seems all right. <sighs> Can everyone unready and just ready up, please? It doesn't seem to be working. Oh, no, Potter's in. No, it's fine. No, stay there. Potter's in. If you can ready up, Potter. No, now Graham's in. What's going on? That's it. Let's try that. No. That's annoying, isn't it? 
Yeah, if everyone can unready and just ready up, please. Just once, just unready and ready up. That would be great. Thank you. That's it. Thank you very much. Yeah, I'm looking forward to racing here. This is, uh... This is cool. That's it. DJ can. Right, that should work now. No. Original, if you can do that as well. No. How annoying. I'll tell you what we'll do. Let's, um... Let's change it to four laps. Change event settings. Oh, you can't do fuck all. You can't do nothing. You can't do nothing. Let's come out, start a new one. And those people that couldn't find the room, um, they might be able to find it now. I'm going to take the headset off to do this, then I can see chat. Yeah, we'll just start a new room. It'll be fine, won't it? God, my, my hair is ruined. <laughs> You're like, yeah, I know. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's Sunday night VR. Um, I'm the streaming VR Resident Evil Sunday night. Right, Mount Panorama. That's fine. Five laps. Uh, we can have like all the way up. That would be cool. Grid start. That's fine. GR3, that's fine. Yeah, bosh. See you later, Mark. Thanks for coming in, mate. Thank you. Love doing this. So cool. So thank you for coming in and being patient with me, not being able to see chat. I do appreciate it. Right, get yourselves in here. We'll, we'll try again. It's just such a treat, and those that are racing in VR, they will tell you in the chat. This is just sitting here and just racing. It's just such a lovely, lovely treat. And once you put that headset on, you really are in that car. I will do, Dean. I, I have tried um, a, uh, what's it called, a Grand Canyon experience many years ago, but that was still pretty good. But yes. Is there anything to do in it, Dean, or you just float around? I know obviously it's an experience sort of program, but is there anything to do in it? All right, let's get in the headset and we'll try again. it lovely right we've got a full lobby five laps we might even do this twice if we're having uh, if we're having a good time why not five minutes of qualifying rather than Gran Turismo just putting this in the same place every single time Yeah, I don't know why it does that. Look, come on. So you have to come out and then go back in. Strange, but it's all good. Ah, oh, it's just lovely. Look at that. <laughs> oh, God. Who wouldn't want to do this all night? I do.
son? Do I what, sorry? No, mate, no. I don't know where your earphones are, no. How would I know where his bloody earphones are? Although, to be fair, I'm always asking my wife stuff like that. Do you know where my such and such is? She goes, no, why would I know? Well, I don't know. <laughs> Bloody vision cars piss me off. They sound like a cat, don't they? Yeah. Hoping for a win here tonight. She's sitting in a Porsche 911 RSR. <laughs> Leave me a space, I'm going for it, I'm afraid. She got no rear view mirror as such, she just got this. Uh... Oh, fucking hell, don't park there. You got the little TV screen on your dashboard. We're up into sixth at the moment. Let's see what this lap is like. Hoping to start sort of third or fourth would be nice. Unless anyone is um, improving on, oh yeah, I was going to say, unless anyone's improving on their laps behind me, it's put me back up to seventh, but that's all right. There's going to be sort of, um, there's going to be first and second corner shenanigans, maybe even third and fourth corner shenanigans. Yeah, if Sim Hub works though, I'll, I mean, I'd love to get the motion platform working. Just worry about the view for you, because if I'm up here like this, you know, moving about, what's that like for the camera? It's not as good, is it? You know, if I'm round here on the old motion platform, it's not going to be as good. So, but it'd be fucking cool to have it working, wouldn't it? Right, let's start race. Cooper's in, nice one.
Yeah, seven. Potter's in the front, then Wang, DJ Ken. Right, we've got some work to do here. Look, there's already fruit in this, I can see. Look how much stuff is happening in VR though, with no slowdown. Beautiful. Fucking hell! <laughs> what the fuck? What a place to put a car park. Seriously. some catching up to do now. There's a few shenanigans behind me as well. That's fine, I'm full for a, a big gap behind me. I just need to catch up with the lads in front. Probably have two races here if you fancy it because this is one of my favorites we must do Nautch life for tonight as well maybe some one lap sprints at the end which is always fun just literally one lap sprints oh shit Oh, for f oh shit, I've got quite a big barrier collision there as well. Oh, balls. Yeah, who's that behind? They're going to get a freebie. Johnny Wang. Someone else in a yellow banana car behind me.
so weird not looking at chat. It's taking me a while to adjust. <laughs> first thing. It was one of my favourites alongside the Brands Hatch. anyone. Trouble is all the fast lads are uh, ahead. Never known me to be quiet so long, have you? <laughs> it doesn't matter, does it? it? I'm enjoying the racing, I must say. Being able to just concentrate on the racing is fucking awesome. Sitting in this car is <laughs> actually blowing my mind. You sort of get used to it after a while, and it just becomes almost like just full immersion. Last lap. Yeah, I'm not making any head ground on the faster lats up ahead, I'm afraid. The tyres are fucked as well. Can't park there when there's a blue flag.
makes me makes want to just put my hand out to this sort of seatbelt thing they have in these cars. It's supposed to stop you falling and rolling about, but it just looks like it's really there. Right, if you don't mind, we're going to do this race again. Because I'm still not in me mojo. I'm slowly getting there, I'm not in me groove just yet. Gonna nip to the little boy's room, give my rest eyes a rest for two seconds. Cool. Still a good race then. <coughs> Hello Panzer, how are you? Yeah, softs might not make one stint. I think it'd be alright. I think it'd be fine. Um, little boys room, straight back. Two seconds. Stay exactly where you are. I am enjoying it, Panzer, yeah. Yeah, I'm enjoying it a lot. Right, we'll go again with that one, if that's all right. It is amazing, um, Larius. It absolutely is. Right, you've all readied up. We're going to go straight again. Let's do it. <laughs> Matt, we've been chatting for a while. <laughs> Love it. <laughs> right. Start qualifying. No, don't start scanning. No, just, that's it. <laughs> nice one. Let's go. That's a lovely car. That's one of the legend cars, isn't it? What Mike's uh, driving? Oh, fucking hell. Oh, bullshit. Bastard. Well, I better make the, the next uh, lap count then.
have scrubbed this penalty off and then that'll be one lap uh, to, to rule them all. Right, this lap, ladies and gents, is the one. Penalty up ahead. Yeah, so that'll move him out of the way a little bit. Oh shit, it's fine, got it, got it. Let's see, that'll move him out of the way. Hopefully that was a half decent lap. Pole at the moment, but obviously everyone else has got to do their laps. What the fuck? Who's driving the wrong way? This ain't a Forza fucking lobby. <laughs> what are you doing? Hole at the moment. I did tell you it was the lap, didn't I? Did I stay first? I think I might have done. What do you mean players are still initialising? Don't do that bullshit. That's it. Well, hopefully you're having a lovely evening. As I say, I do appreciate you being here. This is lovely, so uh, yeah, if, you, uh, if you're enjoying it, leave me a little cheeky like. Other than that, you just uh, relax. Oh, I did keep first, nice.
lovely job as they say. Right, let's see what we can do. Slow through there, come on. Ouch. laps to stay ahead. Shit. <laughs> Oh, yeah, just stick it on the side there, Dick. Thank you. Well, we're doing all right so far. I don't even know who that is behind me. I sort of quite like that. I don't know, but also I want to know. <laughs> in our own as they say. I love actually using these mirrors. You gotta use them, you gotta look. see the car, that's something, gives me a little bit of room. I wonder what the weather's like for DJ Ken back there. 
That's what I'm thinking. I wonder if it's still winter for him back there. I think we'll do a one lap sprint of the ring next just to give you an idea of what we get up to because it is a lot of fun just literally one lap sprint no tire wear no fuel wear just start to finish got quite a gap there Concentrating. Oh shit. Oh, and a fucking. Oh! <laughs> what the fuck? <sighs> Come on. Just that one small mistake. Look at the gap though I had as well. Look, no one's here. It's not like they was on my ass. Oh, balls. Three seconds as well. Yeah, there's a car right, there's two cars right there. Oh, that was a shame. Oops, oh, sorry, Ken. I couldn't see what way you were going there. Right, okay. Fuck, but we can still do something. Yeah, this won't be it. He's like, oh, how's the weather back there? <laughs> that was a shame, wasn't it? Last lap and I'm full. That's a real shame. No, don't do it again. Don't do it again. For fuck's sake. Still, the tyres are pretty fucked. Maybe I should just go a bit more careful towards the end. And I have been ragging it as well.
you know me, I would do this race all day bloody long, but we're going to go to Nordschleife on a one lap sprint. I think we'll stick in GT3, why not? Because that's the one we're currently in. That was cool. Fucked it up for myself, but that was actually a really good race. <laughs> that was fun, question mark? Yeah. What, my father-in-law brought me in... Ow, just punched the fucking metal. My father-in-law brought me in a tea, so I better go and have it. Ah, oh, shit. Right, two seconds, just going to go and get my tea. Never punch your rig, it's not worth it. Even if you do ruin your own race. Awesome to see you can actually race online. <laughs> yeah, just got to concentrate, I know. That was all right, it was just a silly mistake. You angry? No, of course not. I enjoyed it as well. Yeah, thank you for coming in, everyone. So we're going to change to Norchlifer. And trust me, this is fun. This is fun. We're going to do one lap. We're going to do uh, just a, a thing. Uh, we're going to do a thing. We're going to do it on sunset. We're going to do set by host. So I'm going to set where we go. We're going to take all the tire wear off, all the fuel wear. Can we veto Wang? <laughs> He's too good, isn't he? Oh, lovely, Andrew. Yeah, I was playing it earlier, actually. It was cool. Uh, that's fine. Yeah, let me just have a bit of this. You did the opposite of racing today. What's what's the opposite of racing? Where's the Jack Daniels? Well, I better stay compass mentis, aren't I? Wouldn't the VR be good if you still had the coffin rig? I suppose it would, but... Um, where we're doing sort of GT3 uh, setup, you know, it is this is like a GT3 posture setup. I would be laying down. It would be a little bit weird, but yeah, yeah, it would be good. I love my rig. I'm not planning on anything, any changes. I know that's me, but <laughs> that's me saying that. Oh, right, Racky. Oh, you left for a ski holiday. Oh, lovely. Oh, how are you, Oblifrick? That's you in the race, isn't it? You're not alone. <laughs> yeah, hopefully you're enjoying tonight. Are you enjoying it? Let me know if you're enjoying the stream without the so much chatting, but more racing. It's not very often you get a race like that from me, is it, where I'm qualified first i'm up okay i made a stupid mistake but ended up still being third it's not very often you get that from me normally one slight hiccup and that's it i'm in the chat fucking around and sort of just you know but now i'm i'm in the race oh god i love being in vr absolutely love it i don't think i'll be playing any more 2d uh gran turismo i really don't Right, I'm just necking this tea because it will go quite, uh, go um, cold. Oh, you just completed it. Yeah, I completed it a few days ago, actually. Oh, you're up here, feather pancake. I got you. I got you. Yeah, it's lovely to have you all in. I think we've still got a full lobby, haven't we? Let's change that. So we're doing a one-lap sprint of the ring. This is fucking... Awesome, and I've, it's going to be great in VR as well. Right, once you've all readied up... Oh, seems to have hung for some reason. No, we're all good. Right, ready up, and then I can set the... Um, I can set the grid up for us. So me, um, Ken, and Glenn will be together mid towards the back... Uh, Johnny Wang's going at the back. Original's pretty good as well. How are you, Neil? Yeah, thank you for coming in. 
Right, once you're all readied up, then I can um, do the starting grid. It's brilliant, Frederick. Yeah, it's fucking lovely. Right, so... I'll come down here. Where's Glenn? Where's Glenn? Is he not readied up yet? Dude can't reach out at the moment in VR. <laughs> well, you're in VR or I'm in VR. How did you type it? <laughs> yeah, everyone ready up for me. Oh, Glenn. All right, hurry up, Glenn. We'll wait for you. So the Grey Wolf and Scotty, if you can ready up for us as well, please. Just make sure no one needs me while I'm here. It's all good. Right, let me know when you're coming back in, Glenn. We'll wait for Glenn because we're a community here, so we like to we like to wait for each other. And because these are one lap sprints, we do three or four of these over over and over again. I know that might sound a bit like what? Why don't you just do a four lap race? Nah, this is better. This is full adrenaline, um, testosterone, off the fucking starting grid, and who can be the first in the ring? I don't know, MCR, if you, you do it yourself, just go to um, vidi, uh, videos and do most popular. Right, okay, Scotty, if you can um, ready up for me, please. So there's lots of new names in here. Just make sure that you're driving clean, especially on a race like this one, where we are all hell for leather. Um, all right, okay, DJ Kylie and Glenn, 6th and 7th, that's fine. Bit of power... Uh, let's put him back up with us. Where's, um... Okay, yeah, let's just leave it like that. That's fine. Oh, Johnny Wang. He's going at the fucking back. That's fine. Right, let's go. Yeah, I don't actually know what my most popular video or stream is. I don't know. Um, maybe even that video where um, I'm showing how to use uh, Euro Truck and American Truck on the Xbox. That might be a busy video. I'm not sure. It's probably going to be bus sim or truck driver or something like that. I suppose it's a bit sad that I haven't, you know, that was like two years ago, them really busy streams, and I haven't um, bettered them since. But who cares? We're not here just for figures. If we was, then we'd be doing things differently, and I like doing things like this for the pure, pure fun of it and the community of it. That's where I'm at. Right, start race. This is going to be cool. I'm turning... The sound up as well. Oh yeah, it's going up. Just hope we get a nice clean start. I've just got a black screen at the moment. Anyone else got a black screen? Oh no, no, it's alright, it's good. Oh god, that is loud. I'm going really loud, all right? So I probably won't talk on this one. Yeah, that's it. Right, sixth. DJ Ken's in front. Beard's behind. Johnny Wang's at the back. Full immersion. Let's go. Who's spinning me? That is loud. 
<laughs> oh, it's pretty cool when it's so loud, bloody hell. Fuck me, this is intense. The lighting is beautiful. and clean you two. Bloody hell, dude. I can't believe how much I'm actually enjoying this. This is just incredible. I love the way the car really does lean into the turn as well. Can't really sort of see that in 2D, but the whole car tilts up when you're on the carousel is really good. There's quite a bit of movement in the cab. Right, we're third. I don't know where everyone else is. Can't see anyone. That's the thing here. You can have quite a big um, gap if something happens. What a technical accomplishment this game actually is now. Bloody hell. Whoa, 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 that nearly went then. Fucking love this. Oh my goodness. 
I can't see any cars. We're going to have to go again. No, can't see anyone. Okay, well, we've got a, a podium anyway. I think there's someone just up ahead. detail inside is incredible as well. Stuff that you just don't see when you're playing it in the game in 2D. That was a good race. Or a good drive. Wasn't much of a race, but a good sprint. Lovely. Lovely. That was Grove, yeah, it was cool. We're going to do that again. It's amazing you don't get car sick. Yeah, because I don't know what it is. I think because you get you get sick in VR when when your mind is doing something, but your body isn't doing the same thing. So, for example, when I stood up earlier a couple, uh, yesterday and played Call of the Mountain and you're walking forward, but you're, but you're staying still, your brain gets confused and it makes you feel a bit like, ooh. But here... I'm sitting in the car, there's nothing really to get sick about, you know, it's really weird, yeah, yeah. A grainy look, well, it could be the, what they call the screen door effect, it's not, it's not like looking at that monitor, there, it's almost like you've got, I don't know the best way to describe it, almost like a thin sheet of material you're looking through, uh, that, that's normal, that's screen door effect, that's just the, the way it is, yeah. Right, let's go again. I'm up for it. See you in there. Right, come in and ready up. It is a bit of a pain, keep taking it off and putting it on, because I get a nice comfortable position. <laughs> then you've got to find it again, but it's worth it to come and have a chat, etc. Right, okay, let's, uh, let's get going. Bosh. Yeah, I think we'll leave it in exactly the same place. Glenn's in now, nice, so in the, on the next one. I think we'll have two more, we'll have two more. And then we'll either finish and do something else or go somewhere else. I'm going to turn it up again because that was really cool. Having it almost too loud. Because sound is a lot of immersion as well, isn't it? Oh, it's put Glenn up the front. Nice. Okay, here we go again. Here we go. This is a little regular we do, actually. One lap sprint to the ring. Porsche looks fucking delicious, doesn't it? That DJ Ken's, uh, I presume it's the same Porsche as this. It's all about working your way through the pack, especially at the start. Oh god, I followed Glenn. Shit. Right. Got the beat. Oh, fucking hell. Who's this? Oh, it's Chris. Okay. I thought that was Ken. That's alright. Happy to 
draft off of him a little bit. Move us away from the rest of the pack. You might want to just look out for other people on the track, if you don't mind. I think the next one we'll do at night, eh? Yeah, we'll do one more at night. That would be really cool with a light in around here as well. Imagine how much money Sony's actually made recently since this has gone on sale. And not only that, the, the extra games that people have brought as well. Crazy money. Let's hope they invest back into it. Right, we see some cars. Okay, that gives us something to head for. We're fifth. That was uh, not what I expected. Vilvikak is next. It's fine. It's not fine at all. Look, I've got fucking four and a half second penalty. Oh shit. <laughs> I think I just killed someone. Now it's fine. It might have been Kenny as well, so. <laughs> no, I think it was Chris. Maybe it was too loud this time. <laughs> Fucking hell. Styled it. You wouldn't have even noticed. I'll just edit that bit out. It's fine. 
Yeah, this one's a bit messed up, isn't it? Yeah, I'll just edit that out and put me straight to the finishing post. <laughs> Can't believe the penalty I fucking got. I mean, do I deserve that? Yeah, Sunday night, if you've got a green badge next to your name and you're a member, I'm going to do a member stream Sunday night with um, Resident Evil 8. And I've never touched Resident Evil 8. I don't know anything about it. I literally don't know anything about it. I think, hasn't the tall woman, isn't she something to do? Or there's someone in it that's got something to do with the family from Resident Evil 7. I know it's not a following story, but there is a connection, I think, isn't there? But yeah, I'm really looking forward to that. Right, we're going to go again. I'm going to put a couple of variations in this one. Yeah. <coughs> Who, who's he talking to? <laughs> who's he talking to? My hair's a disaster. Change the penalty? No. Well, yeah, I suppose so. Yeah. Okay, we'll have a look. We'll have a look. I thought that was change the penis. I was just like, I can't. I just can't. Right. Preset weather. Custom weather. Right. We're going to go. Do they do fog? <laughs> Should we have thick cloud with torrential rain? I wanted fog, that's what I wanted. I thought they did fog. Because I wanted night time with the fog. Um, yeah. Yeah, just a rift dash, yeah. Cloudy and chilly. Should we go for a little bit of rain? Light drizzle. Fuck it, let's go, let's do it. Let's just do it. Yeah, let's do it. Put Kenny at the back with me. All right, I will. I will. <laughs> yeah, a little bit of rain. Oh, shit. Should we do this? Should we do it? We've done it, haven't we? This could be fun. I mean, it'll be great in VR. That's the main thing. Kenny, are you going to get VR? Right, everyone ready up, and I can do the uh, the grid. See you later, Sophie. I was hoping it was going to be uh, fog. I'm sure one of the settings, because you could only have settings on GT Sport, couldn't you? I thought sure one of them was here at night time with fog and it was just all misty in certain bits as you went down it looks so good right the rest of these lads if you can ready up and remember to be clean as well if you can so dj can viva luck if you can ready up We're almost at 11 o'clock, so we'll probably just do a couple more of these races, and I think that'll be it for tonight. But like I say, I'm going to be streaming on uh, Sunday night as well. Uh, Glenn can come back uh, in between me and Ken. Oh yeah, DJ Ken needs to go at the back with Johnny Wang. Love it. He can come back here because he's good. Okay. 
Right, let's get in. He deserves it, doesn't he, Wayne? Nighttime in the rain. Wow, this is going to be uh, quite interesting. Uh, right, let's... Fuck it, let's go. This is going to be scary, actually. Nighttime with a little bit of rain. Turning it up again. It's really nice actually, not chatting and having it almost too loud. Oh, so it's not proper night. Can't see any rain. Oh, yeah, I can see a bit of rain on the windscreen. Yeah, not huge amounts. Fucking hell, look at Glenn lagging all over the place. Oh, here comes the rain. Oh my god, that is really immersive. Oh my god. Fantastic. Yeah, because it doesn't just rain constantly, it rains different in different areas, which is a great touch. Oh, this is... I'm going to be able to lay in bed tonight, shut my eyes, and actually relive this race as if it's real in my mind. In my mind's eye. It's really that good. Don't hit me again. This is where I'll come off on the last race. Fuck that. It's just a visual feast. I've got everything going on. I've got the lights fucking flashing on the steering wheel in my eyes. It's so good. See me just racing Gran Turismo for quite a while now. You see, it stopped raining in this bit. It's so cool. Fuck, so get the fuck, the 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 fuck. I used to not like the night races on iRacing actually because they've got like a, almost like a little ultraviolet light inside the cab and you get this glow um, around the cab and it looks so good. I mean, you also, like, I'm so used now to actually using my mirrors. I don't really look over there, I just look on my left hand one. I don't seem to look over there much.
I think we might have to repeat this and make it the last race. Because this is good shit. and to have lovely people in the stream as well I do appreciate you being here Glenn lags, isn't it? Who's first then? Is it Ken? Is it is it Johnny Wang? I don't know. I love the way the interior of the car tilts. It's very, very immersive. Right, who's this up here? Who is it? Can I get anywhere near them is the question. I'd like to do this exactly the same again. Oh yeah, here we go. They must have had a little penalty maybe. Ah, he's DJ Ken! <laughs> Spin those decks, Kylie. <laughs> oh, can we get him? It's going to be really, really tight here. Really tight. I'm going for it, though, Ken. Oh, shit. I shit myself there, mate. Yeah, we got to do that again. And that will be the final race of the evening. I think I'm going to make it daytime with the rain as well, though. <clears throat> Almost, yes. Yeah, did you have a penalty there, Ken? <laughs> this has been fantastic tonight. <laughs> you did well. My hair is a fucking mess. Oh, you got one and a half. Oh, well, you did well there. Right, I'm going to leave it exactly as it is. Nearly <laughs> shat myself. I'm going to leave all the grid as it is, but we're going to have um, early morning. How about that? Yeah, definitely, Mikey. Yeah, how are you, mate? Have you had a good stream now? Have you enjoyed being in? Because obviously, like I say, without repeating it again, but this is very different for me. I don't normally just race. I normally talk shit and race. Admittedly, I, let's face it, I've raced better tonight, haven't I, already, let alone, you know. 
blurred all race. What do you mean? Yeah, see you later, Matt. I'm going after this race anyway. Uh, blurred all race. What do you mean, Grey Wolf? You're racing well, original. Very well. Thank, thank you, Frederick. <clears throat> now I understand, Mikey, and I appreciate you being a member. Yeah, I appreciate it. I'll warm your side of the bed up. <laughs> right, never mind chatting in there. Bloody ready up, DJ Ken. Oh, we're just going to have loads of Gran Turismo. Loads of... Uh, I definitely want to make more of that PP. So I want to be able to have a car for like 200 PP, 300... 400 so at any time we can go what do you want to race oh we had fun last week so on those um 400 pp pull out my car it's all sweet and perfect yeah that's what i want i haven't watched any f1 no no it's lovely mikey isn't it yeah right okay let me do the grid it should still stay the same uh okay right okay we're gonna do this Glenn, because he's been winning the last couple. Then me. Then DJ. Oh, and Johnny Wayne can go right up the back. There you go. Right, last race. Let's go. What's your question, Davidoff? I bet it's about train sim, isn't it? I know it is. I know it is. I'm... I know it is. Go on, quickly answer it. I'll see if I can see it. It's going to be, are you streaming train sim next week? I know it is, Davidoff. I know it is. <laughs> All right, let's go. Last race of the evening. So, same conditions, but during the day. Actually, early morning, so. What a little setup, though. PlayStation, Gran Turismo, PlayStation VR. <laughs> they got to keep on top of it, though, with the software, haven't they? Because very soon... You know, as what's happened with the PlayStation. Yes, it was cutting edge. But obviously very quickly it gets overtaken by um, PC stuff. So what they need to do is just make sure they're giving us the software and the game innovation. Oh, that's even better at night. You can really feel uh, that rain. That's, that's good. Fucking love racing with DJ Ken. It's good. That livery on that car looks splendid as fuck. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Straightened you up there, boy. <laughs> God, this is fantastic! <laughs> oh my God! Fucking hell! Whoa, 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 whoa! I got it! I got it! It's fine! I got it! I got it! <laughs> I got it! <laughs> you can't drive when you're pissing yourself laughing.
No, don't. No. Yeah, I don't know what happened there, Scotty. Did you just break and... Yeah, I wasn't ready to break yet, but you seemed to break really hard, which then pushed... and then pushed you onwards. Sorry, mate. Oh, fuck. Karma, innit? Oh, balls. Oh, that's a shame. That was quite a big crash as well. I've just taken Glenn, but I've got a three second penalty to get rid of. to have a rematch same thing let's go what do you think who's up for one more <laughs> well at least you know I'm enjoying it eh? Looks like we have actually got some fog early morning, but I wanted fog at night. Actually, we will have one more if you're up for it, but we'll take the rain situation out of it. Let's have uh, a traditional blast, I think. But since VR, nighttime and rain is a lot more of a sort of usable, viable option rather than just, oh, let's do that for a laugh. I mean, you can race in rain and and nighttime with VR, it's actually really, really good. Caught up with Johnny Wang, but he's got half the penalty that I have. Oh shit, I was pushing myself there trying to I'll go four and a half seconds. <laughs> no point me fighting too much because I've got the penalty. That hurt. Yeah, we'll have one more. Are you up for one more? I love this car as well. This is my GT3 car, without a doubt.
gonna go again, but I'm gonna take the weather situation out of it. Just a nice clear day. Got a full flare, it was alright. Right, I'm gonna stay in VR. Not gonna take it off. Uh let's have a look. Davidoff, what do you think of uh, oh god, uh I could just about see it. Yeah, Drive Club had really good rain, didn't it? Bar first for the star shiny. Yeah, I think we have actually done that, yeah. Am I still a member without my badge? No, you're not, no, Davidoff, but don't worry. Yeah, I don't want you worrying. No one has to no one has to be a member. I never push it. Um, yeah, so, no, once your badge goes, then no, but, uh, yeah, whenever your badge goes, that will be when you're not a member, but don't, don't even worry. I never push it, I never, you know, hard sell or anything. Uh, custom weather, let's just go preset, let's go afternoon. Uh, yeah, custom, no, preset, yeah, cloudless and pleasant. Don't forget to change your tyres as well, by the way. This is it. This is the, the absolute last one. Again, once a little boy's room for a quick pit stop. Go on then, hurry up. Bloody hell. <sighs> you see my dog laying down. Can you see her? <laughs> Look at her. I've got her a nice big comfy bed, but she likes to lay in it and have her head out on the stone floor. Crazy. <clears throat> yeah, it would be good if all tracks get the weather, yeah. She is gorgeous, yeah. Let me um let me just do something here. I might be able to make that text a little bit bigger. No, I still can't sort of see it, no. <coughs> hmm. Uh, VR got the best of you feeling ill. Oh, shit, yeah. You, the minute, with VR, the minute you um you start feeling ill, you're better off stopping. Because once you get VR sickness, oh, my goodness. it's uh, It takes a while to go. Right, ready up, everyone. Last race uh, in the bright sunshine. It's going to be cool. How are you, Panzer? Ready up, and we're going to go. Yeah, good luck. Yeah, yeah, I got gotcha. so you. That's where my chat window is. I've got my PC over there. <laughs> <laughs> then this chart, then this window, then this bloody window. Scotty, are you playing? I don't want to start if um, if you're not. And don't forget your tyres, everyone. Right, there's ten of us. We should have a really good... Um, yeah, podium. Who's that? Podium tell. You might want to change your tyres. Scotty, are you racing? Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and away we go. Right, last race of the evening. Let's fucking get this on. I'm going to turn it right up in my headset so it's really loud. So, so if I'm screaming at you, that's that's the story. Oh god, that is loud. <laughs> oh, I love it. It's part of it though, isn't it? Here we go. Me and you, Kent. Let's go. And Mikey.
No, don't crap. <sighs> Come on. Fuck's sake. This ain't bloody daily races. This is close community racing, there's a difference. Oh, I'm fucked on this one. Yeah, this is ruined. Oh, that's a shame. Still, let's see if we can catch someone up. Even at the back, I can enjoy the green hell. You never know, someone might appear on the track, but I think I'm just far too behind now. Plus, I've got that juicy penalty as well. I have got a box of jammy dodgers with my name on it straight after this stream. Nice cup of tea and uh, an entire sleeve of jammy dodgers. Yum, yum, yum. There's no doubt that my racing would improve in VR though. And uh, with the concentration levels up, we should see some good progress. The first time to test that will be on a daily race stream in VR, taking on the world. That'll be interesting.
Aha, we see someone. We see two people, but I've got a three second penalty. Done a nice bit of driving there to catch up, but yeah, this is no good. Well, it's still been absolute just a blast tonight. And like I said, I'm going to lay in bed tonight, shut my eyes, and I'll be able to see all this detail in my mind as if it's like real, like I've actually done it. That's how real this feels. It's so good to be racing in VR again, it really is. And it's so easy, you just take it off, put it on, one but one uh, cable. It's It really is the best case scenario. Bosh, that was awesome. Yeah, a bit of a shame, that one. I got fucked, but it was good. It was a good last race. Right, that is it, everyone. Thank you for joining me tonight. Do appreciate it. Lots of racing. Lots of racing to come as well. Lots of Gran Turismo to come. And uh, we will uh, we'll be concentrating more, not only on GT3 and GT4, but, you know, the PP 200, 300, 400. So get them ready in preparation but yes that is it everyone i will if you remember i will see you sunday evening for some vr horror if not i will see you uh next week see you later everyone have a lovely weekend